In my past video, I promised to share with you the recent situation of Porter Court to Abba. If you have traveled in that road for some years past, you will understand with me that any little empire that is being put in that road will bring a lot of positivity to people. People have suffered a lot in that road and Governor Alex Oti is doing marvelously well to make sure that the movement in that road is so free. Kindly appreciately watch to the end because as we are going, I'm going to be explaining and also I'm going to show you the recent Abia State Electricity Plant all right, that is functioning now okay and I will also show you the present thing that uh, Governor Alex Oti has done within Osisoma Acid. So if you're watching this video, watch it with patient while we go, right? And don't forget to stay subscribed because the next video is going to be from Aba to Owere. All right. Okay, before we go on, I just want to show you a little bit of portal court. Here is first artillery. So from first artillery, I will also show you a Leme Junction before we now head into this Aba Road properly. So all you have to do is fasten your seatbelt and watch this video till the end. All right, let's go. No doubt you've been hearing about Oyemil in Port Harcourt. Here is Oyemil Junction. Then after Oyemil Junction, you will get the Eleme flyover before the junction. Eleme Junction. Okay, so from that Eleme Junction, I'll be taking you properly till we get to Aba. Please fasten your seat belt. And if you have not subscribed to this channel, just subscribe because next video I'm about to show you is from Aba. To Owele. Like I said, this period I am on tour to show you around the vicinity before any other thing. So, this is my little way of carrying you along for you to see what is happening within your area, whether around or in abroad. All right, let's watch together. Here is LMA Junction. Okay, so let's kick off. In the year 2012, 2011 downwards or even up to 2013, this road was one of the most critical roads in Nigeria. I had a very ugly encounter in this road when I was traveling from Obibo to Port Harcourt. But today, this is one of the best roads ever in Nigeria, if I'm to say, because this has a four lane, not just two lane. This is four lane, okay? This is one of what the governor of Abia State is doing, okay? So this road is going to continue right like this till it gets to Osisoma Junction. So the road is still under construction. More reasons why you should patiently watch to see this present situation of the road before it becomes better. <laughs> So if you are traveling to Obibo, it is now very simple and easy. Obibo is not encountering that uh, road Wahala because I know before there used to be a very big problem in the aspect of road. Even the last time I traveled inside Obibo recently, their road has become so nice kudos to the river state government and that is what is going to happen in Iba state very soon because the present government is trying his best to put up this to he gets to Iba state
Okay, here is Obi Bo Junction. If you are going through my right hand side, you'll be going inside inside Obi, but that is Afam Road. Okay, so and the Imo River is not far from Obi Bo Junction. You're just gonna see Imo River right now. Imo River is the demarcation between Abia State and the River State, and here is Imo River. So, welcome to Abia State. Before now, if you just cross this Imo River, the next thing you that will hit you is bad road. In fact, this place used to be a very critical road, but Governor Alex Oti just fixed it. And there is one thing I understand in this road construction. Governor Alex Oti just picked most of the horrible part and they fixed them first because this is rainy season, okay? So what he did was to fix the horrible part part of it then gradually start working from the town okay i don't know if you understand this he picked from those critical points that is disturbing people that is costing lives all right he fixed it first then he now gradually started from town and coming when you are going as we are going you will observe what i am telling you perfectly Here is called Emo Gate, okay? Just take a look at the other side of the road, you will observe that they are doing massive work there all right do you know one thing that baffles me in this road construction is when i saw the thickness of what they are doing don't worry i will still show you before the end of this video okay when you see the thickness of the road you will understand the main purpose for this you will understand that this is well planned okay so like i said he is picking the most critical part of the road fix them first make it more treble then gradually you start work from somewhere and that is what the present government is doing so if you are seeing bad road do not murmur there, there is major work going on in front i'm going to show you so let's keep going Please, if you are watching this video, don't forget, my name is Okawa Victor, your real estate consultant in Owere. The main purpose for this video is to show you around. This is just to tell you that I value you and I want you to know what is going on within our vicinity, okay? So, because I know a lot of people have longed so much to know what is happening in this road. This is exactly what is happening in this road. Okay, so all you have to do is to do where to subscribe because if you check my videos, you will see one or two properties that you might like. And even sometimes I go on a tour in a different state, of which I'm doing right now, and even within the state. So this all you have to do is just to subscribe so that you don't miss out in any of this.
I know you may just be wondering why the work is going this way. You know, we, we, you see them walk this path, you do not see them walking in the other side of, of which I have explained that. Don't worry, very soon we'll get to that point where the massive work is coming from. All you have to do is be is to wait patiently because even the about electricity plant that i'm about to show you is just around this road okay so don't skip don't miss it let's go <laughs> This is Obehe Junction. Obehe Junction is a popular road as far as Aba Road is concerned. Aba to Portacot Road is concerned. Obehe Junction is very, very popular road. In case you have not seen it recently, here is Obehe Junction. Sometime last month, I came to Abia State, but not this road as well, but I traveled from Omaha here to Abareba. On getting there, I realized that the Abia State government has awarded that road from Omaha here straight to Abareba. I heard it as a news, but when I get there, I realized that they have started a massive work. Check out a road that was awarded to three different construction companies this video is not to promote any government or what but if you see what is good i think you have just to say it okay you just have to say it so i think i'm seeing what is good in other states something good is happening share your thoughts feel free to share your thoughts in this channel on what you think that is happening in other states is he right or wrong is this man trying or not does he need to put more effort or not so you can feel free to share your thoughts This is the Abia State power supply. I mean, electricity plant that is being that is functioning 24 hours in Aba. Okay, this is where it is being planted. So you will get this electricity plant before you get to railway flyover. Now I have showed you. All you have to do is subscribe. After this junction, all you'll be seeing is massive construction work. No doubt. <laughs> So anytime you want to travel to Aba Mem Park, if you are following this road, this is the shortest call. Just stop at this junction, take your right, you see yourself at the park. <laughs>
you see from this point to Osisioma before it used to be a very critical point but the, the road is under construction from here now to Osisioma of which a certain part has been delivered you can see the massive work when I say massive work I mean massive work is going on in this road okay that is why I said after taking care of the critical pass in this Aba road governor Alex Oti is now gradually coming from town and uh, according to his project he is hitting that Imo river very soon and anytime soon okay I want you to use style look at the thickness of the road tell me what you see just you can drop it on the comment section please the thickness of this road even when the road has not been delivered because they have not put as fat on it and all that so this is just the chippings and the compacting uh, level of the road construction so what do you see tell me what you see on the comment section um, or the thickness to me is amazing please because when you see a when you see a road that is being that is designed to last for a long time you will know even via from the constructions you will know This road that was abandoned since is the same road that can take you from Potako to Enugu non-stop. It's a straight road from Enugu to Potako, which shouldn't be abandoned. And thank God the recent governor is doing his best to recover this road. This road was in a this road used to be in a mess. Shortly in this video, I will show you how this road used to be. Just let's go. Let me show you. Just take a look at this. Just take a look at this properly. Take a look at how people are suffering in this road. But guess what? It is all over. Very soon it will be all over. All thanks to present governor of Abia State. I'm telling you, this is how this road used to be, especially during the raining season. Okay? See how they are. So if you just buy your car today, before you do it, you just drop it because the road itself will spoil it for you. Look at how the road is. This is how it used to be before. Hmm? So this is the reasons why I just love the present government government in Abia State. Please, sir. Uh, <laughs> I wish you can view this video, please. Thank you. God bless you. Continue your good work, sir. No jokes when I tell you that this is going to be a four lane construction. You can see the two lane this other side, and the other side will take two lane as well. And this is how it's going to be it gets to Port Harcourt. Here is Ariaria Junction. <laughs> I, I guess they are all happy because this is not how this road used to be. Here the Marema.
please if you have watched this video to this extent all kudos to you my name is okawa victor your real estate consultant in Owere. like what i just did i like showing you around so that you will know the environment even though you are not from abia state you are supposed to know what is happening in abia state if you feel so and you can actually get it from this channel all you have to do is to click on the subscribe button and if you want to do anything land investment land banking buy and build properties or you want to buy a house or you need a consultancy in real estate all you have to do is just to put me call call me on 070-330-626 eight one okay so in a way presently we have some properties that is below two million and just two million and even five million naira you can start somewhere remember i always tell you plant that tree today and let it grow tomorrow okay so after this video right now tomorrow i'm going to be dropping another video that is taking us from abba to or where all you have to do is just to click on the subscribe button so that you don't miss out in any of these cheers okay thank you for driving with me here is osisioma flyover okay we'll do this same thing tomorrow all right because we'll be driving from abba to our stay subscribe i wish you good bye